Welcome to this transformative self-coaching program to help you integrate the pattern, feelings and beliefs of feeling undeserving and unworthy of abundant well-being. This program is designed to help you feel better now, and more empowered to handle this issue in daily life. To best benefit from this program, full screen is recommended. Sit upright and still, and while you listen, follow the ball or pattern with your eyes. Alternatively, you may tap on one or more EFT tapping points. Are you ready? Please take full responsibility for your well-being. Section 1. We begin with the negative before reframing the issue. Even though I struggle with this pattern, I choose to still love and accept myself, and I am open to a more empowering state of being. Take a deep breath. I always felt like something was missing, that I wasn't complete or enough to merit a wholesome life. Whenever opportunities for happiness or success came, I subconsciously pushed them away, believing I didn't deserve them. I looked at others thriving and couldn't shake off the feeling that such abundance wasn't meant for me. My attempts at improving my health, relationships, or career were half-hearted because deep down, I doubted my worthiness. I often found myself in a cycle of self-sabotage, especially when things started to look up reinforcing my belief in my unworthiness. The joy in my life felt fleeting, as I was convinced it was only a matter of time before it would vanish, affirming my undeservedness. I harbored envy towards those who seemed at peace with themselves, wishing I could feel deserving of such contentment. My inner voice was my harshest critic, constantly reminding me of my perceived lack of worth. I shied away from deep connections with others, fearing that once they knew the real me, they'd see I wasn't worthy of their love or friendship. Any form of praise or recognition made me uncomfortable because it conflicted with my deep-seated belief of not being good enough. I struggled with accepting help or kindness, feeling unworthy of such gestures and fearing hidden motives. Past failures were not lessons to me but proof of my inherent lack of worth, making me hesitant to try again. I saw life's challenges not as opportunities for growth but as confirmations that I wasn't meant to live a fulfilled life. Moments of happiness were tinged with guilt, as if I was taking more than my share of joy, reinforcing my unworthiness. I often felt like an outsider looking in, believing that true well-being in body, mind, and spirit was for others, not for someone like me. Section 2. Embrace this soothing loving perspective to speak to your inner child. Maintain your attention on the screen, following the movements of the shape or pattern with your eyes. I am sorry you felt incomplete, as if you were not enough to have a wholesome life. I give you permission to heal and embrace your completeness. I am here for you, understanding how you pushed happiness away, feeling undeserving. You are worthy of every opportunity that comes your way. I empathize with your feelings of not being meant for abundance. I encourage you to trust in your deservingness of all life has to offer. I am sorry you doubted your worthiness, affecting your efforts. You deserve to pursue your health, relationships, and career wholeheartedly. I see the cycle of self-sabotage you were caught in and offer you comfort. You are worthy of sustained success and happiness. I understand how fleeting joy reinforced your feelings of undeservedness. You deserve lasting joy and abundance in your life. I am sorry you envied others' peace, feeling unworthy. I celebrate your uniqueness and the contentment that is rightfully yours. I acknowledge the harshness of your inner voice. I remind you that you are more than enough, just as you are. I am sorry you feared deep connections. You are worthy of love and friendship, and people are lucky to know the real you. I see your discomfort with praise. I encourage you to accept recognition gracefully, knowing you truly deserve it. I understand your hesitance to accept kindness. You are worthy of help and kindness, with no strings attached. I am sorry past failures made you feel inherently unworthy. You deserve to see them as steps towards your growth. I empathize with your perception of life's challenges as confirmations of unworthiness. You are meant to live a fulfilled life. I am sorry happiness made you feel guilty. You deserve to embrace joy without reservations or guilt. I see how you felt like an outsider. I remind you that well-being in body, mind, and spirit is your birthright, too. Section 3. 
Now, visualize positive change. Take a deep breath. I am choosing now to embrace my completeness and worth, recognizing that I am deserving of a fulfilling and abundant life. I am open to receiving and welcoming happiness, believing in my inherent worth and right to success and joy. I could consider the abundance around me as a sign that I, too, am meant for greatness and fulfillment in all areas of my life. It would be nice if I fully committed to my personal growth, health, and relationships, knowing I am worthy of the best. It is possible that I can break the cycle of self-sabotage by affirming my worthiness and embracing the good in my life. I can start to see joy as a permanent part of my life, deserving of every moment of happiness that comes my way. I am willing to explore the feeling of contentment within myself, knowing I am as deserving of peace as anyone else. I have the opportunity to silence my inner critic by affirming my value and embracing self-love and acceptance. I am capable of forming deep and meaningful connections, deserving of love and friendship without fear or doubt. I embrace the idea of accepting praise and recognition, acknowledging my achievements and worthiness openly. I am ready to accept help and kindness without suspicion, recognizing my worthiness of generosity from others. I am beginning to see failures as opportunities for growth, not as reflections of my worth, but as steps towards success. I am receptive to viewing challenges as chances to thrive, deserving of a fulfilling life filled with growth and happiness. I am shifting towards enjoying happiness without guilt, allowing myself to fully embrace and deserve every good thing in my life. I am open-minded about belonging and well-being, acknowledging that I am just as deserving of a balanced and joyful life as anyone else. Section 4. Bridging the journey from challenge to transformation. Remember to maintain your focus on the screen, following the movements of the shape or pattern with your eyes. Even though I always felt like something was missing, as if I wasn't complete or enough to merit a wholesome life, I give myself permission to heal and embrace my completeness, and I am choosing now to embrace my completeness and worth, recognizing that I am deserving of a fulfilling and abundant life. Although I subconsciously pushed away opportunities for happiness or success, believing I didn't deserve them, I am worthy of every opportunity that comes my way, and I am open to receiving and welcoming happiness, believing in my inherent worth and right to success and joy. Even though I looked at others thriving and felt that such abundance wasn't meant for me, I encourage myself to trust in my deservingness of all life has to offer, and I could consider the abundance around me as a sign that I, too, am meant for greatness and fulfillment in all areas of my life. Although my attempts at improving my health, relationships, or career were half-hearted due to doubts about my worthiness, I deserve to pursue my goals wholeheartedly, and it would be nice if I fully committed to my personal growth, knowing I am worthy of the best. Even though I often found myself in a cycle of self-sabotage, especially when things started to look up, I offer myself comfort, and it is possible that I can break this cycle by affirming my worthiness and embracing the good in my life. Although the joy in my life felt fleeting, reinforcing my belief in my unworthiness, I deserve lasting joy and abundance, and I can start to see joy as a permanent part of my life, deserving of every moment of happiness that comes my way. Even though I harbored envy towards those at peace with themselves, wishing I could feel deserving of such contentment, I celebrate my uniqueness and the contentment that is rightfully mine, and I am willing to explore the feeling of contentment within myself, knowing I am as deserving of peace as anyone else. Although my inner voice was my harshest critic, I remind myself that I am more than enough, just as I am, and I have the opportunity to silence my inner critic by affirming my value and embracing self-love and acceptance. Even though I shied away from deep connections with others, fearing they'd see I wasn't worthy once they knew the real me, I am worthy of love and friendship, and I am capable of forming deep and meaningful connections without fear or doubt. Although any form of praise or recognition made me uncomfortable because it conflicted with my deep-seated belief of not being good enough, I encourage myself to accept recognition gracefully, knowing I truly deserve it, and I embrace the idea of accepting praise and recognition, acknowledging my achievements and worthiness openly. Even though I struggled with accepting help or kindness, Feeling unworthy of such gestures, I am worthy of help and kindness, with no strings attached, 
and I am ready to accept help and kindness without suspicion, recognizing my worthiness of generosity from others. Although past failures were not lessons to me but proof of my inherent lack of worth, making me hesitant to try again, I deserve to see them as steps towards my growth, and I am beginning to see failures as opportunities for growth, not as reflections of my worth, but as steps towards success. Even though I saw life's challenges not as opportunities for growth but as confirmations that I wasn't meant to live a fulfilled life, I am meant to live a fulfilling life filled with growth and happiness, and I am receptive to viewing challenges as chances to thrive, deserving of a fulfilling life filled with growth and happiness. Although moments of happiness were tinged with guilt, as if I was taking more than my share of joy, reinforcing my unworthiness, I deserve to embrace joy without reservations or guilt, and I am shifting towards enjoying happiness without guilt, allowing myself to fully embrace and deserve every good thing in my life. Even though I often felt like an outsider looking in, believing that true well-being in body, mind, and spirit was for others, not for someone like me, I remind myself that well-being in body, mind, and spirit is my birthright, too, and I am open-minded about belonging and well-being, acknowledging that I am just as deserving of a balanced and joyful life as anyone else. If you were tapping, you can stop as we go to section 5. Preemptive gratitude for transformation. I am grateful for the strength and wisdom that have guided me through my journey of self-discovery and healing. I thank the universe for aligning with my highest good, allowing me to embrace my worthiness and abundance in all aspects of life. I appreciate my inner resilience that has enabled me to transform my beliefs and embrace my deservedness of well-being. I am thankful for the love and support that have surrounded me, reflecting my inherent value and worth. I cherish the moments of clarity and enlightenment that have illuminated my path towards embracing my true self. I am filled with gratitude for the endless opportunities for growth and joy that the universe continuously presents to me. I honor my journey, acknowledging each step as a necessary part of my evolution towards a life of fulfillment and happiness. I am grateful for the peace and contentment that now fill my heart, knowing I am worthy of every bit of happiness. I thank my higher self for guiding me with gentle wisdom, leading me to a place of self-acceptance and love. I celebrate the infinite possibilities that await me, grateful for the journey that has brought me to this moment of empowerment and gratitude. Section 6. Closing and Next Steps. Take a deep, rejuvenating breath. Congratulations on completing this transformative session. Take a note of how you feel in comparison to how you started. Be attentive to the reduction in the emotional weight of associated memories and changes in how you react to things that used to trigger you. Feel free to repeat this program to completely shift and reframe this pattern and beliefs. For more details, see the link in the bio or description below.